Hey, look, it's a one-off, not an LP of this game. That we will then LP. I'm not gonna LP this. In the future. This game might. is not worth the, it. There's going to be a point where it's like the one let's left, though. Yeah, I get you. you understand. There will be that point. No, what? no, actually there won't. You know why? Because right. four will be the one that's left. I'd rather play this than four. I would, I, I would also rather play this I than play four. like about two hours of four and I watched almost a full LP of four and I was like, I don't want to Four play has this. like a 10 hour escort mission. Mm -hmm. I know. I've seen it. I seen it so too. So I'm I'm gonna play the origins. I need to find out how all this crazy shit started. This is this is the most origin story that no one wanted I've ever seen in my entire life. All I know is you play as a trucker and that's awesome. Also this pass there. That you good buddy? Tree top tall and wall to wall. Now Travis you messed up some bitch. That's not what great voice acting. Play it on a gig, bud. Now that I'm being said, silent hill. The, the story behind this game in its like its production mm -hmm. and the game that came out it is absolutely yeah, you said this. Amazing. baffling that this game came out and was fine. As decent as it is. Like, right? it's decent. It's not like a classic. Would you say, would you say it's better than um, uh, Homecoming or Downcoming? Very yeah, easy. cool. It, it's, it's totally fine. And it has some, like, continuity issues. Well, you know, where all, every single game always has something. They, they didn't really think it through. And there's one... There's actually there's two really major design problems with the game, but from moment to moment, it's fine. It, okay. it looked really good for a PSP game. Well, as he, I, I think it says, wow, that trap is great. It, it cool sounds guy. really good. It's it's, um, it's written and designed by Sam Barlow, yep. again the guy that was behind Shattered Memories and the first story. The, this this one is the most naked of the we want another Silent Hill 2. Yeah, yeah, okay. It, it, and, and that nakedness only appears in the alternate ending, which is the true ending. Yeah, yeah, you told me about that. And the sure. reason why it's the true ending is because the default ending of this game is not canon. Oh, mm, <laughs> I'm, I'm always, I always hate that. I hate that in fucking Prince of Persia 2. Yeah. I, sorry, sorry, not Prince of Persia 2, fucking Prince of Persia Warrior Within, and I don't like that here. So I have a, I'm getting really sick to death of the oh god I'm gonna run over someone trope how to start a horror adventure There's it, it's so overdone now but. also uh, I want to point out that this is the PS2 version yes it's not the PSP version I I, I saw it on uh, sale for like two bucks and I was like why why PSP not PSP version had a, a warning that said hey man when you started the game instead not the content warning that was different but it had this warning that says hey man you want to play this with uh, headphones, headphones yes and uh, in the dark which is weird to see on a portable system. And the reason for that, there's a lesson. Ooh. Hey girl. The reason for that is that the game uses a, a form of virtual surround, if I remember correctly. Right. Like Silent Hill 2 and 3 also do that. It seemed like if you're making a type of horror game and you have to chain it to a handheld, you yeah. have to make certain, like, like, you know. 2 and 3 have it, but it things. works through stereo, so it's not as effective. Stereo. This, this one will use it relatively well. But the big problem. Look at this cool guy. Is that if you played this game in any form of light at any time. The game is unplayably dark. Uh, it is impossible. Was there a brightness option? There must have been. No. Oh, fuck. It is impossible <laughs> to be yeah. areas such as the Come Cedar uh, uh, the Cedar Grove Sanitarium uh -huh. in daylight. Okay. Straight up impossible. I'm a cool guy. Look, I already have my fucking light right on my chest. Why would a trucker have that? I guess he figures For, for a lot lizards. Right, okay. So that was that was a different person that was in a rain slicker, and then there was a different girl no, that was here. No, that is all the same person. Why did she take off her rain slicker? Because ghosts. That girl, did I hit her? I need to catch up with her. Well, that ghost, despite the fact that girl's not a ghost at this time. See, this are... Okay, yeah, fair enough. I, I like the fact that, like, crazy... Not crazy, but general-looking trucker guy is really that concerned with... Clearly she walked off, she ran off, she's fine, but let's make sure, yeah. shall we? So I got run, I got stance. You have stance, and you have multiple melee attacks. So yeah, the production of this game... What, I've what was that? What? Okay, the beat coming in, yeah. I thought it was a chainsaw revving. Yeah. 
That was, a, super that was a combination of the beat coming in and you flicking your flashlight on and off. So the production of this game was super troubled. It was originally not made by Climax. It was made by a different company whose name I cannot remember. Really? Um, and that was an over-the-shoulder like Resident Evil 4 style game. Ooh, nice track. Yeah, Mary Elizabeth McGlynn, for sure. Yeah, no, I got it. Her and Akira Yamaoka made some good fucking tracks. I bet they would make some awesome music babies I don't, together. I, I think she's a terrible voice director, yeah. and I don't think she's a very good voice actress, but good ass singer. Lady got some pipes on her, she does. Good ass pipes. Okay. Uh, yeah, so that was a like over-the-shoulder RE4 kind of game, and that thing was a fucking disaster. Is there any footage or screenshots of it? Yeah, there's the early it? footage of that game okay. exists. I don't remember this at and, all. And, like, the Konami was like... Uh, like, even in the era of Konami farming out these games to indie western devs or whatever, they went, Bruh, no! Mm. And and the game was, like, completely redone by, by Climax. You're never alone. Uh, we really need to do a second episode of... Should be um, we really need to do a second episode of Did You Know Gaming for Silent Hill because there's way more stuff. There's a million like, stuff. Like, we basically only talked about Silent no, Hill Oh, no, Shane sends us, like, something about the comics. I'm going to, like, find him and spit in his face. Uh, well, we can write it. Oh, okay. Like, we can research and just do it. It'll be like, wow, you did all the work. Good job. Did you so know Konami ruined their own game with the HD collection? And I, th true. I, I think with all the, the, still all the bad blood about, um... PT that even more people would like want to. Now, like, hold on for just a second. Can I? This is when the, the influence of the movies started to show up. Uh huh. And the influence of the movies only show up, obviously, in the American ones because the movies didn't exist when At, the Japanese ones were coming out. Right? Okay. Uh, but, like, both the, this, these guys took a little bit of inspiration for the film, the first film. And the guys yes. who made Homecoming, which was Double Helix, they took a lot of inspiration from the film, and I yeah, believe that, that those were ultimately Jesus. Oh my God! So this is a house that you uh, actually yeah. only see in Silent Hill One in the opening cutscene. Interesting. Uh, in a in like a little flash, oh. and that that house so is like in, in the middle of a plain near a mountain. It is it is not. It is definitely not alongside the fucking road to Silent Hill. Look at this fucking but hero. that's some nitpicky shit. Yeah. Is this going to be playable? Yes. Oh, wow, okay. We're now, go upstairs. I'm torn because the PS2 I, I, houses such is. unbelievable lookers such as 2, 3, and 4. Yeah, and this, even though it was developed on a PSP, it can only look so like, much better on this PS2. This looks like a decent-looking PS2 game. Yeah, yeah, but not, on, not on, a patch on the shoulder on, on of the PSP, it looked really good. Yeah, I bet it, it did. It looked really, really good. Ooh. Shit's on fire, bro. <laughs> no time to look at plants, motherfucker! There's no time. Can I, I, can I, do you know if I can take the, did you beat this? Yeah, I beat it. Okay. I, uh, what do you, I assume. The you, only Silent Hill game I have not beaten is four. Really? Yeah. Okay. I dude. can't let that, dude, those last, like, two levels, oh my god. Jesus! I have so many baffling problems Christ. with this scene. Holy, this is fucking scary. I have so many, I have so many problems. Because, do you know what, is it like, because it's, wow, you're going, you're hitting it really hard right off the bat with huge ramifications here, but it's like with a random trucker. Well, also, like, the fact is that, like, a it's implied that... Her like, head's bobbing and shit. It's implied creepy. that the fire in Silent Hill 1 was an accident. God, I got flipped turned upside down here right? for sure. But here, if she's burning in the middle of the, of the pentagram, it, uh, it implies that it's intentional. In addition... Oh, fuck! In addition, like, there are, like, weird, like, visual elements of the scene that don't make wow. sense. Like, how she scorched and burned inside a perfectly untouched by flame mm. pentagram. Well, is, the, yeah, is that being nitpicky or is that an actual problem? I don't know, game? but it's like, it's like... Whoa, fucking devil may cry! Yeah, and she's using the Mark of Samael to, to, to push Samael's the fire. Samael's a good guy. Which is baffling... Because her intent is to die in this fire. Her intent. Which she even said, let me burn. So that she can, like... Right. So the whole thing is that they were doing the, 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 the ritual to impregnate her with a deity that would then she would then give birth to. And then they would rule over and then give them superpowers. And at some point, it went out of control and everything burned up. So she wanted to die. You know, I'm And this thinking... is, a, 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 like, a, you know, a problem. She yes. shouldn't burn. 
So why should would she be using her magic powers to help herself get out of the no, plane? No, it's fine. I, I'm taking a hardline stance. You don't, don't put yourself in a satanic ritual where you're going to get impregnated by a deity. Well, she it's didn't not really gonna work that. that. Well, you know what? Don't put yourself in the situation. Get born by an evil mom? So, no. Yeah. Her mom's evil as shit. Uh, I, I, I have hey. an inkling. Someone help so her. look how much of a fucking hero oh, I am already. Yeah. I should also point out that I'm not a doctor, but that kind really? of that kind of burn coverage usually leads to horrible death. It usually leads to or, but I mean, uh, and you hear they mix in the the sirens. A little bit, very very good. A little bit. Uh, that Silent Hill little little kids can take a lot of punishment. Yeah. So I guess the 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 reasoning behind that is like well. The de the the deific power inside her <laughs> causes her to to live even though like in Silent Hill H Silent Hill one like Lisa's like why won't she die it's crazy she should be dead with these burns ooh nice and then they just dump you right in there where am I I already like him better than both Silent Hill like American absolutely made protagonists absolutely sorry uh, sorry. <coughs> Protagonist. Silent Hill. Oh, I love that. That's just the map from the, the like, when you actually bring up a map. Well, that's that's because all the maps you get in those it. games are either town maps or pamphlets or shit like that. That's why they all share that design. Yeah, but I, I like I, for a lesser game would probably just need to see make an, okay. a rough illustrated map, but and then it would turn to this. Yeah, there's my so house. This is when uh, combining the maps started to become totally impossible. Go. Right, okay. This is the moment... Please come again. This is the moment in time in which, like... It's a taco shack! The ability to, like, point out this was here, this was there, Coons. and try and combine the maps yeah, became, a, like, a total fool's errand. Toluca! Because none of them fit together properly. Yeah, no, and, that's... And in, in some cases, they have wildly different scales. Mm. It's super weird. I did it! But yeah, you want to get to Coon Street at Alcamilla Hospital. I'm gonna get to Coon Street, which yeah! You are, which you are currently on the west side With of. With my combos. I remember when I loaded this up, and that... that Can't turn on my flashlight anymore. Yeah. Uh, that... Dun, that You know, that first beat That's, like in that. here? Wow, this looks even better than yeah. when we started it up. Absolutely, because well, they got to add the fog in. Yeah, they get to add the fog in, and I think they added, like... This added 16x9 for the PS2 version, at least. It asked to Well, really the PSP out. was in 16x9. Oh, it really was? Yeah, that's... Okay. Do, do you remember holding a PSP? Uh, yeah, and I remember throwing up every time I ever it was did, because like I hated holding the PSP. It was 9 by 5 or whatever, but it was a, a pseudo-widescreen resolution. One thing I'll give about the Vita, it doesn't hurt my hands when I hold it. Totally. Because I had to it, test... I had to test PSP games for a few months, and, like, my hands would get... would get fucking cramp up, because it's so uncomfortable for I remember, me to hold. I remember, like, loading this up, and, and like, I'm starting to get excited. Mm. Especially since, like, this area... Oh, there's a med kit to your left. Um, I believe... Like on the oh no! It's just the or? shattered window. Yeah, okay. I, I miss. I misread it. I, I, it'd be fine to weird if they gave like, me a head mouth kit. This rat. is the first time like you've been back to this spot since Sun Hill One. Oh wow! Okay. This yeah, is the right. Alcamilla Hospital, not Alcamilla uh, Brookhaven. This is where it all went down. Mm -hmm. Oh god, yeah. You know, whenever I think about the first Sun Hill movie, I'm like, man, I really like that movie. Like up until like the. Fucking info uh, uh, dump uh, that uh, I didn't. Uh, I never really. You know, liked, I but. I've looked, and somebody please find and tell I me. I assume this is a save point. Yeah, it's yeah. In, it's in the shape of the floweros. Uh, but like I have looked and looked and looked and never been able to find the almost hour of cut footage from that movie. Mm -hmm. There is there is nearly an hour. Of I don't that think movie. you're gonna find it unless they released it. You know? Yeah, there's nearly an hour of that movie. Okay, that, that was just completely cut out. And the entire thing was um, Sharon. No, not Sharon. It was Rose and Sybil. Why did uh, that do like, that? Like getting around town. Oh, it's because I'm near the TV. And, and I thought it was sorry. Oh, I thought it was. I thought it was static on my on my thing. There's a map on that wall. Uh, which wall? Right there, there it is. Right. Uh, there was there was like all like just Got one, it. wandering around Silent Hill, lost and shit. Uh, and they had to cut it for time, and then end up having to have a plot dump in that movie because they w still needed to cut for time. Yeah. Uh, and it's a damn shame. I, I really wish that director had been given a second shot to make another Christoph movie. Christoph Gantz like started that series saying, "I want to do Silent Hill 2, but we can't." Have you ever seen Brotherhood of the Wolf? I have not. His other movie. You should see it. It's fucking incredible. Yeah. It's really good. Like, it's not really a horror... It's a little bit of a horror movie, but it's like a 
old timey horror action movie is fucking great. Uh, yeah, and it's a shame because that the second Christoph Gans movie, what with like the whole problem that he described, it's like literally like he already did. Silent Hill has stuff. so much fucking backstory that we need to get out of the way, or else nothing in Silent Hill two makes yeah, sense. Yeah, yeah. Because you need to know that the place is fucking cursed and shit for really bad for that story to even make any sense. <laughs> Oh yeah, rock him to the beat, man. Yeah, this is this is when Yamaoka started to have like slightly more like hip hop, really like, house. Well, not hip hop, not about, but, but more like beat conventional. As you're walking hey, through, you a doctor? What? No. Can I help you. That fire last night. The girl who was burned. Is she here? A girl. We've received no new patients in the last day or so. Was she hurt? She was burned all over. Are you a relative? What did you say her name was? I don't know her name. I was oh. the one who saved her from the fire. She must have been brought here. Is there another hospital? Yes. Yes, I'm there's sorry. several hospitals there. Who could help you. I have urgent business to attend to. <laughs> Goodbye. Like, if you go back and look at the Silent Hill 1 soundtrack, like, that thing is, is nearly totally unique compared to all the other ones. Uh, Probably because he was just feeling it out. But there is a lot more, like, angry-ass machine noise yeah, in yeah. that soundtrack than any of the other ones. I, I assume it's because after, like, what, this 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 would be technically the fifth game, this right? This is Silent Hill 5. So, um, I would imagine any, anyone that... Uh, uh, would go, okay, I'm tired of doing this fucking shit. Let me yeah. change it up and let me do something. Well, they, they all have, things. like, variances of their soundtracks. That mm, any suggestions here? Mm, basement. Yeah. Always basement. Wow, this is a weird, awkward cursor. They've all been like that. God. Straight up, all the menus in all the games are like this. It's super weird. All right, second floor, then. Uh, they, yeah, they all they all have, like, differences in their soundtracks, but they're they're pretty su subtle. Mm, yeah. Like, Silent Hill 1 is the easiest to pick out compared to 2, because it's, like, raw-ass machine noise compared to, like, a lot of, like, uh, like, piano tracks. Uh, damn. I thought that that would work. Ooh! I know, right? It's a good-ass door noise. Don't like that noise. It's like Willie's bathroom door's noise. Yeah. It creaks because of the slime. Fuck. Hey, girl. So as you can tell, those are that's a movie nurse. Yeah, yeah. She looks a little more bloody though. Nice. Get that hammer. You got hammer. I got triple H shit. Oh shit! I need to equip it, right? Yeah, with the D pad. Oh, uh, can I equip it from here? No. What? I thought assumed that's what I could do. Uh, maybe. Yeah. Yeah. Here. You can also equip it via the D pad. Okay, I'll do that next time. Yeah. All right, you're good. So, this game, you are now looking at one of the game's big design problems. You picked up a hammer and you Can made... I finish her off? Yeah. How? I don't know. It's been a while, dude. There's different uh, attack buttons or something. Maybe hold the button. I. This is this is like hold. No, hold I mean hold X. Hold X. Okay. Yeah, well, just, just yeah. So that's cool. You can you can you can wind, Damn it. you can wind up for big hits like you could in uh, Silent Hill Four. Right. That's awesome. Because uh, I really want to know how to hit X her. without aiming. I'm not. No, I mean without aiming. Like don't hold R and just hit X. No. Uh, I forget how. Uh, but wow, you're gonna have to learn how. <laughs> Fuck. Well, that brings up the map. You give me that. Huh? Or is she dead now? Nah, she ain't dead. Well, the music hasn't stopped, but there's a lot of blood on the floor, and she hasn't gotten up yet. Okay, that that was forward in attack. That doesn't go low enough. I think she might yeah, be dead, Yeah, she's though. probably dead. Still, though. So, I'm gonna go check uh, your inventory for a second to show off something that I was talking about. You see that that's red now? Yeah. That's because all items in this game break. Oof, I don't know if I like that. And they break fast! God, I wish I hadn't swung so much with this. I know. Okay, yeah, there you go. So that there, leads to a lot of using just your hands. For combos. And it severely disincentivizes you actually fighting any enemies. Because you need weapons for bosses and shit. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah, I'm not... I'm and, not. like, one of the one of the strategies that's really good for bosses is Jesus. to save up a bunch of TVs that you can throw and just throw five TVs at the boss. Right. Oh, God. 
That's fucking amazing that they have that on the PSP. It's it was mind blowing. Because there's some 360 games that still don't let you have a reflection. It's a different room. What you got? Oh, coffee stains. Awesome. Third degree burns. Patient is unconscious. Something has prevented damage spreading to her the internal organs. Tissue damage is limited to the epidermis, epidermis. and extremities of limbs. How is that possible? So that explains what I was. You talking see, about. epidermis means your hair, and that's why it's so funny. Pardon me a moment. Ah ha! There you go. Nelson, okay. I think he's really hurt. I said, ha ha! All right, I guess there's. I, there's one thing to do. Here you go. What? I believe. Oh yeah. Okay, leave then. I guess something will happen. Yeah. I have to fight my shadow. So yeah, clone. from a gameplay perspective, that's like really annoying with the things. You didn't see it also, but enemies have grab attacks that include quick time events. Mm. Which is like, come on. There you go. But when this came out, that was still fresh. It was still super fresh. Oh shit. Hey girl. There's something not right about this reflection. Touch your hand at this bloody spot. Oh wow, that, that's super thick effect now. Yeah. In game too. Touch it. This is pretty creepy looking. Touch it. Why would he touch the fire? How did you... Whoa! That's cool stuff. That was pretty cool. So here's the other big See, gameplay now problem. I've got your power. This ain't right. Is that uh, this is the only oh, game... Oh, fucked up? This is the only game in the series that gives you... What? 100% total control. Of warping oh, into oh, both oh, worlds? Oh, oh, That's cool. Control. It is, except for the problem... That it completely removes the element that's in every single other game. Which you um, don't know when uh -oh, it's Uh-oh, uh-oh, I'm in the Nightmare World. I don't want to be here. I don't want to be here. Well, well, the thing, it's kind of like Metroid Prime Echoes where oh, you, that, you, that has you, you had to go in into the Dark World and you regretted, ew, you regretted having to do it. So there's still that sense of dread, like, oh, I don't want to go here, that, but I that, have that to. That works for, like, the first two areas. Yeah, you're right, you're right. You're and right. then at the end where you're just, like... To complete Health area, drink. to complete the final area, which is a hotel, you, you or sorry, motel, you're you're swapping what? like like fifteen times, and it's it's re like when you're looking for items and things you can't find, you're just constantly flip flopping between both, and it kind of cheapens the other world. Mm, yeah, no, I can see, I can see, or rather the other side. What? It broke. It broke. Great. Yeah. That that's way too little, especially for a fucking sledgehammer. Yeah, that's right. Welcome, welcome to this game. And I can't charge up try, the hit. Try forward and. Uh... It's super weird. Unless I can't do it yet. No, no, there's no, there's no learning of fucking abilities in this game. Are you, okay. Did that kill her faster than the sledgehammer did? Knocked her down more. Try it holding the button when she's down, but not, uh... I, I hold, without being in the, uh, yeah, without, weapons without thing. being ready. There you there go, it that Thank was you. it. It wasn't it. Maybe I have to be near her head or something. I well, you know. just punched, you just kicked her butt. I just so, kicked her butt. So, yeah, so it ends up, like, from the, in the early game, you're just like, no, I don't want to use the weapons. I want to hoard so, them. So that's weird, because that's, like, less combat than, like, um, fucking Homecoming. Homecoming, but it's still More crappy. It makes it so that you don't that's fight enemies, um, which I think was the intention, but, shit. like, it's, the, it's a super shitty way to do it. Mm. Like, degrading single or near single use items are infuriating in almost every single game they exist in. I don't, I don't mind some items, like, let's say, like, a knife would, would break after, like, a bunch of hits, but, yeah. like, big weapons, like, yeah, you should I'm be just able saying, to Yeah, I'm just saying, like, the, the concept is, like, a near universally reviled gameplay design concept yeah. that no one likes. Like, one of the first mods for almost every RPG is to turn item degradation Jeez. off so that you no longer have to repair them. That was a scary noise. Um, there's, a, there's a couple of those Buffy games, and that's like you had really, really good combos, and there were breakable weapons throughout the environment that you'd get, and that's fine, but since it's like... You try you, those doors, son! I know, but I'm listening to the sounds. Try uh, all those doors. 
I want to touch it. Yeah, you want to touch it. You want to get so it. So sometimes there. I can wait. Oh, okay. I thought that was moving. Uh, sometimes I can move the camera behind myself, and sometimes I can't. It yeah. depends on the they are in the camera. Ooh. There's a health drink. Oh. Yeah. Is it stairwell? I can't. Oh, it's yeah, not. there it's you stairwell. go. Okay. Let's go oh, camera you didn't finish angle. exploring that floor above you. Oh no. Oh fuck. Oh. We'll you go gotta back. try all the doors, Matt. Oh, does what? your map work here? Yeah, great. Kind of. So, oh, it's the men's and women's bathrooms. Just try all those doors. Okay. Try um, all those doors. I only try. I didn't try them all. Try all the doors. Okay, you seem to know something. No, I don't. I forget the vast majority. They're of just game. telling me how to play the way you want me to play. <laughs> yes, basically. Fuck that noise. Yeah, this is this. I didn't try this. Well, it's, just, it's standard like horror game, like especially like item based progression horror game thing. Because I already came down this hallway in the real world, and all these doors were locked. I assume you did not come down this hole in the road. I thought I did. Nope. Okay, because it not. seemed very similar. Yeah, trust me. Okay. Whoever's uh, not playing has dramatically better spatial awareness than whoever is playing. We have we have discovered this. Okay. Oh. Uh, not blank blank blank. I've used the blank to contain her power. That's the just, blank blank. That should be Flauros. No one will come to her aid. Something, something, something is one of the five. Blah blah blah. Hide them. Protect them. Sincerely, blank blank. It should be say Dahlia. There's another thingy. What? You got a golden egg. The Phoenix, that's the Phoenix logo from that shitty developer. It's all this goo. Good ass goo. So this really isn't rust right now. It's mostly blood and barbed wire, which is also cool. Yeah, it's, it's like the, we're stuck in ECW world. I think the idea is that it is a similar motif to the Sun Hill one thing, but it's not as advanced yet. Hmm, yeah. Because she just got, got here, injured. right, okay. Whereas in Silent Hill 1, she's been, it, like, fucked up and busted uh -oh. for years. Oh, fuck. He's... No, it's fine. Don't worry about uh, it. Oh, I got scared. You can run away. Yeah, So I think the ability good. to hit the monsters with your fists is a super fucked up decision. Why? You're a trucker. Why would he not try? I can understand sure. James not trying. But Fuck like, you. did you notice you just effortlessly KO'd that nurse with nothing? With, yeah. Oh no, you've been Yeah, there. I came this one. Like, it's weird. You know, you're not wrong that it's weird, but I feel like if the character type is kind of like, ah, he'd punch people. Yeah, I know, but I'm a stickler diehard. What do you want from me? Uh, just, just to... Just to say that, like, yeah, as, I, I think, like, you're right, but I think as long as you're gonna nitpick this shit all day. Oh. Part of mine troubles me with its trembling. Still, I have to put it on ice and lock it away. Remember. Remember the three beauties who cause it to pump are so, so are the key. Age before beauty. Ooh. Get that shit. Yeah. Take a look. Take that look. I don't like how it's kind of hard to see that. It's Imagine how hard that would be to see in the... Um. Oh, well. We have zero numbers right now, right? I guess come back here. I can't pick up the box, so... Look how obviously polygonal the top of that is, yeah. considering it doesn't get affected by the lightning. I, that's a wow. weapon. That's a weapon?! Yeah, hit right on the D-pad. Fuck! You go. That's goofy. That's some goofy-ass shit. So yeah, you don't need to, you don't need to go into the, the fucking menu to, to get that stuff. You just hit the D-pad. <laughs> And up and down does, uh, from between firearms and melee. And, and, and items. No, That's like, stupid. like guns and, and melee, I believe. That's dumb. It's fucking dumb. But guns you would keep, I imagine. You just need ammo for yeah. them. Hmm. Alright. Time to go downstairs. Okay. You've cleared out this area. So, it also in this, it doesn't seem like it's, it's, um... Uh, There's that it, machine noise. It, it doesn't seem like it's uh, really static on your walkie-talkie. It's more like just the filter is like your main. Oh, there's point. there's also static. You just you just haven't noticed it as much. Okay, because I don't have a walkie-talkie. Uh, you do. I do. Well, I, where and how come Shut he hasn't up. used it? All right. Monsters make white noise when they approach you, regardless whether or not you Jeez, actually that's pick loud. them up. Uh, don't worry about it. I can't it. see anything. See, I'm usually pretty tense in these games, it's all Silent of Hills because they're spooky, but you are so empowered as Travis that a lot of that bleeds away from me. Okay. You're uh, really strong as Travis. Well, yeah, because I'm the fucking best assassin in all of Santa Destroy. 
There it Whoa. is. There it is. Yeah. Give me combos. So that was one of the worst because playing this uh, game on a PSP gave you the situation. Give me Cody. Like, Cody yeah. shit. You, you probably didn't know this, but like, you have to actually mash them Take really, really hard I to do those. Hard. But when you do that on a handheld, it's really worth Alcohol. Because you're like, am I going to break my handheld? Yeah, especially on a PSP where I always felt it. Out. I always felt it was kind of, like, not flimsy, but I, I'd, I'd feel really weird about, like, really hammering buns on I it. Bet, I bet you can throw a golden egg in there. Even in this inferno from Out of the Flames, I saw a life born oil. Oh, I wonder if that's a fruit. Or... They probably put that in. Uh, so that would be with select or yes. Yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You do it. That's exactly like the guys that made fucking um, uh, Animal Soccer World. Oh, by the way, check your inventory. You started with uh, the radio. There it is. Okay, sure. Yeah. And also to your right. Is my lucky, lucky quarter. quarter. You want to examine that? I've had this quarter since I was a kid, from when my parents died. It's kind of a lucky charm. Something scratched into it. Looks like 61. Hmm. So there's Mary's letter. Okay. You know, fair enough. Everyone... It doesn't have nearly as many mechanics dedicated to it. Yeah, that's what that is. But, like, it, it's, it's thematically, like, the item that you bring into it, the game with you that has, like... All this thematic significance. So that put that in there, but oh, it's a fucking door. I thought yeah, it was just a weird totally slot a thing. It's a fun, happy door. Oh god, I didn't mean to press it. Should I go back? Is there uh, anything in there? I'd go back and finish exploring that that room a little bit. So this is what I'm talking about. Okay, I can see how that can kind of grate on your nerves and be kind of like, all right, all right, let's after, go. After after. Fuck, I didn't... Because X is examined. Yeah. Oh, but didn't you want to check that stall, see if there was ammo or a gun in there? Well, I want to go back there. I just... And that one was mysteriously a bit longer. Yeah. There's something on the wall in the real world. Yeah, that's that's not a... Yeah. Yeah, walk towards that camera. Uh. Oh! You just open up the toilet. Oh god. You mashed it so hard. Got a plastic level. I don't like collecting plastic Check organs. the last stall. I'm Good. checking it. Just a filthy Just a toy. filthy, woolly toilet. I loved it in Silent Hill 3 where she's like, why would anyone shove their fucking hand in there? That's disgusting. Oh, let me do it. Alright, I guess that's it. That's it. Okay. Oh, see? Yeah. Already! Yeah. Even within right. the first area, it's like kind of like... Like, I think you can circumvent it a little bit by making a bunch of cleaning products. Well, whatever, Travis. You're like, Travis you're fucking... is so powerful in his own game. Oh, there's a health, health drink. It's crazy. I already have so many health drinks. And is there a, any sort of damage? Oh, what's that? A -M -A Amy 31? I don't know. Can I? I can't move the camera. Oh, really? Can you, can you examine it? Oh, there you go. Amy, 31. 31. Hmm. Okay. Uh, hey, it's a key. I got the staff lounge key. I go fucking drink their coffee and don't refill the pot. <laughs> like a badass. It's fucking, uh... Doesn't sound like anyone's in there, so then go in. Sounds like someone's in there. I better go in, like... Mm. A situation like this makes me think of, like... I've never done this, and I never will do this, because it's rude. But... But, like, going to someone's house and just pissing all over their bathroom. Like, somebody I don't like, I just, like, just pissing all over their bathroom. Like, all over their sink and shit. So, where's the staff lounge at? There's the staff lounge, so I just gotta go through there. Directly in front of you. Okay. Just like, yeah, fuck you. Fuck you, man. You love my pee. It's no, I don't, it's sir. An improvement. Willie, I don't. It's an improvement. Yeah. Progressiones. Oh, good camera angle. And it zooms in on that Hemingway. Although the shadow's going kind of nuts on that table there. It would be a lot harder to see if you were playing this on a, like, four-inch screen. Let's go, Coca-Cola machine. I love you. You'll check out that note on the fucking wall. Let me pick up this energy... Wait, energy drink? Yeah, what? Is Why is it energy drink? Lucy 23. Amy 31. 31. Lucy 23. Mm. Why is it energy drinking? What? what? 
Toaster's a weapon. Fuck you! That's stupid. Oh, this is key. <laughs> I look so stupid. Dude, you see what I was talking about? That's, that, that's, okay, so that's totally fine to have a quick item thing. It's actually really handy, but, f like, is that the best that you could have done? Like, and why would you give him such dumb things? Do you see what I'm talking right. about? Like, but but that being said, it's a tiny dumb thing and an otherwise so far pretty solid, you know, yeah, thing. Solid. So, but, it, yeah, solid. It's those things build up over time. Everyone meet at Annie's bar. There's gonna be alcohol. Get crunked. Okay. Oh, that door. Yeah, no, I know. I just I just want to look around a bit more. Everyone, get crunk. It's crunk Please. time. Get cranky crunked. We have more people in the burn unit. That means funding goes up. Get crunked, everyone in the burn unit. If I pour this booze on you, it'll make you heal faster. I don't think it will. Ah! <laughs> that door is locked. So, so all I got was a key. A key. What did it say? Exam room. The exam room? That's correct. Okay. Yeah, check out what the fuck the difference between an energy drink is and a health drink. Yeah, let's just look over the exam. Uh, the exam room was actually early on when we walked in. Uh, we might have to go down. Oh, there it is. You're able to get there. You're also able to save your game. Yeah, uh, but since I'm so such a bad, you know, ass that cannot be beaten, maybe I don't need to. Yeah, maybe. Uh, so you say examine the. Yeah, I want to see what the uh, difference between energy and and health drink. <laughs> it doesn't tell you. Examine. <laughs> Power. Power, you think? Look at, look, examine it again. Oh, uh, no. Look at the label. It's power plus. It's a power plus. Does it really make my punches or melee strikes better? Because like Jesus. It. So, Amy 31, Lucy, Lucy 23. 23. Uh, yeah, that one. Okay, it was this way. It was right through here, wasn't it? Yes, you're totally right. And, and then book it around the See, corner. now that's a, a that's interesting because it gives you a little bit of control, but at the same time keeping like creepy cra camera angles. Yeah, see, Silent Hill Was 2 it this? and 1 and, yeah, had like a, a more free roaming camera behind you, but like they also had like less technical limitations. Exam to room. Right? Like, like I imagine a more rigid camera makes the game a lot easier to run. Okay, well, that's where I gotta put the organos. Yeah, I believe you're missing one. I have two? Yeah. I, usually people have more than two organs. It's forbidden to get it. Dr. Kaufman! Yeah? That's awesome! Who do you think you just talked to at the elevator? Really? Yeah, dude. Well, why would I know this? This is the first time I've played this game. That's cool. Dude, Sam Barlow the loves warriors. him. All the warriors is in the Silent Hill. Yeah. White yes, box please. on the wall. Nail it. Let's see what it says. So, Sarah, Sarah 19. 19. So there, we got all three. Hmm. And here's some organs for some you. Or they, these look real. Plastic intestine. Gross, that just looks like fucking spaghetti. Looks like a bag of shrimp. Looks like Plastic a weird thing. Plastic stomach. That's stupid. Stomachs are useless. Everyone loves stomachs. Everyone loves stomachs. And that's over there. Right, slap that shit. Oh, get that huge bottle of alcohol. That's it says alcohol bottle, but that's a fucking like propane tank. Yeah. Make no, don't get it twisted. Of alcohol. A, a propane tank of alcohol. Right. Hey, girl. Jam that or guy, shit whatever you are. Yeah. Take a look. Let's take a look. So, as as far as I know, this looks like you're missing parts still. Stomach goes here. Yep. Nope. <laughs> There's your lungs. I might be missing a part. Um, yeah, you have to get it somewhere in the vicinity. What was this, liver? That's a liver. Liver should go, like, here -ish. That's That's right. Let's see if it lets me put it there. Nope. Maybe I have to put it in the right order. I think you have to put them in, like, top down. Come on, intestines. I got that guts running through my blood. Okay. It's, it's like a jigsaw puzzle. See the jigsaw? Yeah, there it is. There it Those is. Those are all the organs. No kidneys. No vag vaginas. Another organs in the way. You gotta, you gotta take, you gotta take the liver out and put that in first. Put the stomach in. You gotta do it. See, yeah, th this, this is, is how this, this puzzle works. Cumbersome. Straight up. That's still weird because this looks like it still won't fit. Shut up. 
You're missing something. Wake up, asshole. Probably the heart. Probably yeah. the heart goes right here. You're missing some shit. Oh, well. We'll come back well, later. I'll leave it all there. It looks good, though. He's look looking great. No. You look great. So I guess I'm missing, yeah, a heart. Maybe I should just punch it awake. Just punch it. You're going to have to go and explore more rooms. Okay. Get more organs. <laughs> That's the best objectives like I've ever heard. So I came through there. Or else have an A. Mm. Uh, we'll hit the map. That'll tell you. Also, we have three ladies with three ages that yeah. go 19, 23, 31. That's where that thing is. I haven't been in the medicine room, I don't think. But that's locked. No, it's not. You oh, that, even, that little you, red squiggly. You never even tried that door. That from red? The, you know, from the inside of the exam room. Oh, shit. Okay, I didn't, I didn't see there was a door in there. Uh... Exactly. That door right there. Um, yeah, no, that that's weird. Never before would a game need a mini map in the upper right oh, so it, bad, it? and yet have that actually be go. the worst thing you could ever do Fuck. to the game ever. Well, it's locked, or broken, or locked and broken. Nope, nothing there. Yeah, you're gonna have to scan the the, the remaining rooms on this floor, okay, and on subsequent floors that you didn't check out. Great, it's, it's the way. It's the way to do. Okay, well, let me let me let me save. Yeah, okay. Because I'm not as tough or as uh, or as strong as you as, thought as you were gonna thought, be. As I thought I was. I will not rotate my sows. <gasps> no. How could you? Okay. All right, let's hit uh, now. The map. Big and tough. What do you got? Lobby. Oh, you can zoom out, right? It, it's a weird button, though. I think it's a... There it is. Yeah. Okay, so the first floor is explored, except right. for that. Except for that staircase, the second floor is mostly sealed off. Whoa! What? What was that? That's the alternate map. Wow! Weird. Okay, I, I know what to do. Okay. Go through. Go to. Oh God, this. Go to the bathroom. Like where I came from. Yeah, and zone back into the other world. Oh shit! Okay. All right. Go back to the the busted heart box. And solve the age before you beauty riddle. For which, like, where was that done? Did we already? That was in the nightmare world. That? that was in the nightmare world. Nightmare world on the third floor. So men's bathroom, women's bathroom didn't matter. Well, whichever opens. Not that one. Yeah, lady bathroom. Yeah, that's the one Travis likes to be in. Actually, that is a thematic element. It, that, you know what? You're not even wrong. I think it's really cool that you can see the reflection of the other world. Oh, it's in rad. The it's totally rad. Rare. It's, it's a fantastic little spin on the Silent Hill 3 mir uh, um, uh, mirror room. Jeez. Which is the scariest room in all of Silent Hill. Yeah, I know it. I watched a full video of just that room. And it, it's it's a fucking... It has a creepy ass good ass shit. Ugh. You know, you gotta find that heart thing, which is upstairs, if I remember correctly. So stairs, I guess? Yeah. Uh, where you get the stairs? Yeah. Uh, should be behind you. Yeah. Oh, and you never checked out the door on your right over here. No, keep like all the way to the end of the hallway on and your right. Into right. That door. That's that door is pretty jacked. Oh, death mask. Right. Even the blind have need of eyes if they wish to gaze at the future. The future. That's a great line. I actually really like that line a lot. Mm hmm. I love cool ass cryptic writing. Everyone does. I know, right? It's the, uh, fucking, it's the reddest. Uh, I feel like at this point. The sound is scaring me. Like, you, you. We don't need the lens flares anymore. Like, Witcher 3 has something like that where the, the, cam, uh, where the camera. Um, the game's, like, camera. Has a has a glass to it that is speckled because it's dirty. Yeah. When when you see that the sunlight hits it, I don't like it. Did you did you see that they took that out of Zombie U for the to make Zombie? They just took really? out that effect for whatever reason. You can't turn it back on. Personally, I don't like the effect. I like it because it makes it look different. So but I can understand uh, why. Your box is all the way at the end on the left. Okay. Uh, they here or yeah, here? Yeah, all the way there. Okay. Yeah, there you go. So, if I remember correctly, the uh, riddle for Age Before Beauty is there were three ladies that make his heart go boom, boom, and there were th their ages were 31, 23, 19. 31, 23, 19. So, Age Before Beauty, implying that younger people are always more attractive than <laughs> older people. You fucking dirtbag. So, it would be 32, 
Oh, uh, you said age before beauty. Yeah, age before beauty. Okay, so. I, thought, I thought you meant like, yeah. Yeah. No. So 3223. Sorry, 3123. And then 19. It's a long ass combo. Yeah, it's only six digits, man. But still, you usually think it's like three or four. Bam! Yeah. Now I got the heart! Now go back Gross. downstairs and slap that shit into that dead lady. Yeah. 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 That room is confusing. I'm in a weird spot right now because I, I want to talk about, like, this in regards to, like... Ah! <laughs> so... Let's try this dumb shit. I have started to become totally numb to that kind of scare, particularly in these games. This sucks. Because... <laughs> this is really like, weird. The most classic thing in all the horror games. There you go. Is did you just unlock using uh, a thing or what? I should have expected it. Like something's coming. But like, I want to talk about like remake two. But as of the time of this recording, we know nothing. Right. And as of the time of this airs, we may know something. We may know something. So hopefully that's good. Hopefully it's not like this. Well, like, I never, I never even, when anything jumped out, I don't recall, maybe people can correct me, but, like, I don't remember ever being scared at anything in Homecoming, because it was so poorly done thematically, yeah. and, uh, and see there, I, I was See, that one didn't get you, because they had done the same trick to you, like, too two much. seconds earlier. And, and it went, I was already knew that I, I might be attacked yeah. after a while, so, uh, so I was never really, like... I don't want to use one of those health drinks. You're right. I'm kind of I'm kind of aching. I hit up on the D-pad. See see where that goes. No, nothing. Oh, uh, that, that that is for firearms then. Okay. No, get no. Stop it. Stop. Okay. Um. Oh. For your health. Some status. Yeah. Yeah. Give yourself one more. A refreshing herbal drink. It's good shit. How, how do you know? See. Okay. It has to go all the way to green. That's how I know. Weird. That's the rules, man. No, but I just don't remember that. Okay, that was that door. Yeah, that's... So I bet you'll get the... The eyes are gonna open. And you'll get the eyes. Uh, yeah, that door. Gold door. The, it was the gold door. Goldar. Gold Watched some Power Rangers the other day. He's, he's a cool say. guy. <laughs> he's like my favorite. Really? Yeah. Green Ranger's my favorite. No, no, no. Goldar isn't the bad guy. Like, of the bad guys? He was a bad guy. Green Ranger is a bad guy. was way cooler than Green Ranger is a good guy. That's yeah. You're not wrong, but I yeah, mean, let, 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 let me rephrase that to be more broad. Mm. Villain that eventually joins the team is always way cooler when they're in their villain mode. Yeah, yeah, okay. Well, yeah, uh, I really, I really liked Anubis in Ronin Warriors when he was a bad guy. When he turned good for a little bit, I was like, oh, that's cool. But then when he became just a straight up good guy, I was like, oh, that's not. That's not I know, it's the worst. Oh, like too, like too Vegeta, like they avoided that problem with Vegeta by making him an asshole forever. Yeah, yeah. So, forever. Yeah. The heart goes right here. Just jam it in there. Doesn't work. You're, you know what? That's true. Because your heart, man, it is in your mind, <laughs> in your thoughts. No, take out the lungs. That's bullshit. Take them out. Throw the heart. That's Throw an ugly the heart ass. Up That's an ugly it should ass go game. right here. Around there, yeah. Oh, no, it just goes around the center. It, it, it's in the center, but it's twisted to the left. Right. Ah! Yeah. <laughs> I, even, I even told you it was going to happen. Yeah, but I didn't think it'd be so creepy. <laughs> oh, that was fucking great. So what did that exactly do? You so, had the eyes. Oh, sorry. Yeah, I thought it was just a creepy thing. That's stupid. And now go back to the door to that door requires the you to see yeah, the future. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Fucking dumbass. It's like the most fun I've had in a while. <laughs> I was I, back this Matt, way. I would honestly recommend that you play this game. Like, all the way through, because it's, it's good. Like, it's pretty good. It's just like... Well, you have to go all the way back upstairs and then go back to the... No, you just have to... Yeah, wasn't we'll it? Find, yeah, we'll find our way. But you have to go back in the Nightmare World, for sure. Yeah, no, that's what I meant. Um... It's, it's pretty good, but it's just like, you know, this was the start. This was the beginning of, like, the downcoming, like, I guess. Yeah, but, I mean, like, for this and, um, and, uh, Shadow uh, Memories, like, Climax, certainly, while not doing 
like perfect justice to anything, they're still way better than what we got. Yeah, from yeah double helix and Vatra and double helix. Like, I would say that a full year of my disdain towards Ugh. Instinct was purely based on like built up frustration over Homecoming. Like, I still can't believe it. The double helix made a really good fighting game after making the worst well, Silent Hill I, game. I, I read up a bit about that and. It was it was being made by again like this the someone completely different. Then they merged another company with that company and got rid of the old company, and that was what Double Helix I had. Right down there, right. I think so. So it was kind of one of those situations where you know they they were kind of handed something that wasn't already great. Okay. Death Mass. Yeah. I wonder if they stole that from uh, remake. Yeah, this was after remake, but I mean that's a weird thing to quote unquote steal. Death Mass. This reminds me of something. Like, it reminds me of fucking uh, yeah, that minority, re head. minority Report. That shit. Oh, that made. That, oh, look how creepy it looks. That turned my fucking stomach in Minority Report. That whole fucking sequence. Oh, that sequence is hilarious. I love oh. it. And when it's like Mario Kart guys taking his eyeballs away, I just use my fists. Use your fists. Fuck you. It's super tough. Look at this super threatening villain. That you can easily just punch. Okay, well now there's two. Yeah. And then you kill one. A what? So this this is where the uh, the what the IV drip would actually help because it's that big. Because it has that big white arc. Yeah, you're not wrong. But I committed myself. And yeah, well, and with the weapons, you also have multiple attacks. Yeah. I, I I don't like how I don't really get three hits. I get two, and I can't cancel out of one or anything. I can kind of stagger one hit and wait and do another one, but like oh, that's not a very satis satisfying thing to, to hit. Sorry, this. Yeah, you see his head turns towards that that little. Oh, so yeah, I love those things, huh? They're not not really doing anything. No. So this location is like where Alessa's being Jesus. kept, more or less. Oh, look at that cool shit. Oh wait, what? I didn't know it was a door. I thought it was something to look at. It is. Okay, good. It's both. What? Ew! So ah. it's it's it's, it's uh, your discount line figure. Wait, what? It wasn't Mash. It's not Mash. Weird. You have to wait for the icon to appear. That is such a thing from the movie. You're gonna Whoa, die. Fuck You're gonna that die thing. immediately. Jesus. Yeah, you spoke. Yeah, I, was, I know. I was gonna. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, wait, spoke. is that? That okay. increases your power. And then equip a TV. Throw a TV at it. I don't have a TV. Sorry, but... a bottle of alcohol. Yeah. Or a toaster. Toaster! This is so stupid! Yeah. Oh, the vicious toaster kills all nightmares in Silent Hill! broke it in one shot? That's because it's so strong. Oh no! Oh, uh, well. So what you can do with those is if you hold the button, you'll throw it at uh, them, and it's one of the... <laughs> And it's one of the best, uh, it's one of the best, like, uh, attack options uh, in the game. Okay. Which sucks, because like I said before, you end up saving up, like, five TVs for a boss. Yeah. And then you, the boss is just you throwing TVs at them. <laughs> so that was Silent Hill Origins. Yeah, so you, can, you guys can see, like, why I would get nitpicky. Like, over the course of, like, 15 hours, like, some of these goofy, goofy things, like, just really build up and get, like, eh. Yeah. But. It's fine. That, the, the, the trip through and the story about Travis, because this is a, a self-reflection story as right, much right, as it, as, as it should be. pretty decent. Yeah, okay. It's pretty good. No, that, was, that, the, was still, the, that was still good fun. The final area in the hotel has one of the better, like, fucked up bosses in the series. Okay, I should look that up at the very least. Yeah. Alright, there you go.